Hey everyone, coming back at you with another video. Getting that pen out of my hand. Um, this is gonna be like my second technical plan with me and my new planner, but my first like actual plan with me and using this. So I used this this week for a rewind plan and it turned out really cute, I like it. And then I still need to do a rewind plan for this current week that we're on, but I wanna actually use this planner, like, current week. So I'm going to do a plan with me for this week. So I'm gonna be using the Caress Press Mermaid Kit. Or Mermaid Kisses Star Kiss, Star Kiss, Star, Starfish Wishes. I can't say that. Um, so I'm gonna use this. I did wanna use it in my old planner because it has the date cover-ups and like, you know, like I feel bad covering up like these black letters. I feel like any kit I have that has date cover-ups I want to use in my old planner. But I've been really wanting to use a caress press kit and I really wanna use this planner this week. So we're just gonna do it. We're gonna do it and it's gonna be fine. So let's go over what comes in the kit because it's a boatload of stuff. So you have your deco, a payday sticker, um, some functional stickers, a don't forget a date night on Instagram, and a quarter box. We have our headers. We have some quarter boxes and half boxes. We've got our littles. We have our functional sheet, and I'm gonna say right now, other than this weekend banner, I doubt I'm gonna use anything on here. Um, we have our sidebar and our headers. Oh, that didn't that didn't go on camera. We have our full boxes. These are straight gorgy. We have our washi sheet. We have our, ha um, these are ombre boxes. <laughs> and then we have our washi and some more deco for good measure. So I'm pretty, I'm pretty jazzed to use this kit this week. So let's do this. This is really like a June color kit, but I do what I want. So let me get things I'm gonna use right away. All right, I have a lot of things happening. Since this kit's so like colorful and stuff, I don't think I'm gonna use like my Big Brother stickers this week, just because I feel like that might be distracting. And I've used, I used a couple of Caress Press stickers. There was a freebie that came with this kit, or that came with my order when I ordered this kit. Um, that had like the countdown to summer on it. <clears throat> and so I use those. So that's the most I've done with Caress Press stickers. So this is, this is new to me. And they feel just so buttery soft like everybody ever says. Um, I just, I can't with how big this like drop is. I'm sorry. Like I was, I was watching Plan With Me videos all day today. It's like five o'clock. I was off today. Well, I had to go to a meeting this morning, but pretty much just been on the computer doing homework and or watching YouTube all day. Living the dream, you could say. So I got that bottom washi down. What do I wanna do? I don't know how to do this thin washi at the top. Oh, I'm nervous. You really do have to work kind of hard to get these stickers up. Oh, whoops. I'm really not sure how to work with stickers. Especially non-removable stickers. That seem lined up. I apologize if my head's in the shot. 
Did you see my last video where my head was actually in the shot? Like, I was appalled. I'm like, for once, I wasn't over-exaggerating. There we go. That's a little crooked, but you'll live. And then we'll put this green one down. And then, so on the 4th of July, I, like, ordered all the stickers from Etsy, like, every last one of them. And Caress Press had this Lovebirds kit up for, like, $20. I mean, it didn't have, like, all the stickers that I think they normally come with, but, like, it was $20, and I had to get it. And they had, like, 15% off, which is not a crazy amount, but when you never do sales, I'm down. Like, I am so down. This is crooked as shit. Oh my god. Um, and it was so freaking cute. Just go on her Instagram and you'll see the kit because she posted like a plan with me, or not a plan with me, but uh, just a picture of it. Oh my god, it was so gorgy. And I really wanted it. And it was in my cart. And I didn't look to see how many they had left. And I kept on shopping. And then it was like, oh, sold out. And I'm like, gosh darn it. Just my luck. Um, but I did get lucky at Frank Hearts U. As if I was actually at, like, at Frank Hearts U. Like, I was shopping at Frank Hearts U. Um, oh, God. Yeah, Frank Hearts U. They have all the kits that I want. I love Frank Hearts U. Um, I will forever continue to buy from there. Um, but they had, I've been wanting their nautical kit, surprise, um, for a while. And then they have their Wizard of Oz kit, which I'm not a huge Wizard of Oz fan, but like, I can get behind it, you know? How did I do this? Okay. Just want to make sure this is facing the same direction, you know? Um, but their Wizard of Oz kit is so adorable. So I really wanted it and I'm like on the fence, like should I buy it? They also had 15% off and they never have sales. So that's what sparked this whole buying frenzy that happened. And then they only had one of those Wizard of Oz kits left. Cause it's like stock level, one available. I'm like, oh, hit and purchase. Oh God, this is so crooked. How do people do this? That's really extremely crooked. Can you see how crooked that is? I guess it doesn't look that crooked. Anyways. So I got the Wizard of Oz kit, pretty excited about that. And I wonder if I can. And then I got, I mean, you're gonna see a haul of all this stuff once I get it. Um, and then I got a There's no way I can peel this all the way across Yeah, that's fine. I just gotta deal with it Okay How do I want to do this? I was going to put these down. I feel like there's going to be no take backs once I do this. It's going to throw everything off though. I'm gonna do this later. We'll just put these on top. Because the date covers are gonna come down too low, I'm just gonna have to put that on my hand. All right. So. Should I fuck with the sidebar? I don't know. I didn't I didn't really think this through. I did not really think this through. 
So I should be able to I'm going to, I'm going to do the sidebar. I feel like this is really going to be a disaster playing with me. Good thing I'm playing with Caress Press in like two more weeks again. Hopefully I'll be better prepared. I need to get these extra stickers out of my way. I think I didn't finish what I was saying about the kits that I bought on um, 4th of July because I got so sidetracked. Um, but I got the New York kit from Odd Loop. Very, very excited about that. Never been to New York. Probably not going to go anytime soon, but you know, it still counts. And it's such a gorgeous kit. I think it's going to be perfect in the fall. And you know how you just buy kits sometimes because you're like, I don't know when it's going to go on sale like this again, you know? Like, I don't need any of this, but I'm going to buy it anyways. Yeah, that's my life. That's me. I need some washi. I know what piece I want, it's just a matter of getting it off the paper. Okay. I can't grab anything today with my hands. My hands are broken. Hopefully this is lined up. And is also enough washi. Not lined up. Also not enough washi. Perfect. Everything I dreamed of. We're gonna have to roll with it. We're just gonna roll with it. Oh, and I'm totally off camera. Surprise! Off camera again. No one's actually surprised. Um, da, 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 da. what do I want to do? How do I want to do this? So, let's let's do. Yeah. Just do our headers across the top here. of other stuff to talk about. I just filmed the haul. It's got um, just a bunch of washi that I bought from Michael's and Hobby Lobby and like I never use washi anymore because I always have all these like full kits that include bottom washi and everything. Um, 
<clears throat> so I don't know why I still buy washi. It's just like a habit and I see a sale and I have no self-control. So I have some new washi. Don't know when I'm ever going to use it, but it's new. It's pretty. Um, so I really need to work on a cleaning schedule. So I think for one of my habit trackers this week that I put in the sidebar, I'm going to put like a 15 minute clean down because, um, I think it's cleaning's easier when like you don't set like a huge like long list of things to do you know you just like this is like really stuck to my hand um you just kind of break it down into small parts and I think if I do like 15 minutes a day like oh dishes done fridge cleaned you know trash out that sort of stuff it'll be easier to keep up with it and I won't get like super overwhelmed when the end of the week comes and I'm just like oh my god I have Sunday off, and I don't want to do anything on Sundays, you know. I haven't done my 15 minute clean today. Thought about it though. That counts for something to somebody, doesn't it? Alright, so those is down. And... going with these guys. These are harder to put down. Just, I feel like the sticker has like no body to it. You know what I mean? Like it's just like flailing in the wind. It's boneless. And I also really need to mow the lawn, like, mow the lawn or get a boyfriend, one of the two. Because then I don't have to mow the lawn if I have a boyfriend, right? That's my plan anyways, I don't know if it's true. So, just things on my to-do list. It was raining this morning, that's why I didn't mow the lawn today. I haven't mowed my lawn in like a week and a half. It's getting real ratchet. Holy Jesus, that was almost a disaster. My dog really wants my attention. Something fierce. It's fucking crooked as shit. That's what I get for not lining it up how I normally do. I'm gonna put down this Monday because I'm feeling like it's feeling some type of way about it. Monday's down. Let's go on with the other headers. I just feel like this is a real disaster. Probably just gonna tie all this hot mess plan with me. And it's not even good chatty, because I have nothing to chat about. Oh, we can talk about Big Brother. We can talk about that. I've got something to say about Big Brother. Um, I don't have a lot to say about Big Brother, but... Um, so... Frank. Let's just start with Frank. Frank is like running this house right now. If you don't watch Big Brother, this is gonna be really boring to you or you're gonna be like, damn, I need to watch that show. Preferably you should be like, damn, I need to watch that show. I can't. I can't like line this up how I like to. Damn boneless stickers. 
There we go. Oh, I really thought that was the wrong day for a second. I'm like, fuck. Right day. Anyways, so Frank's running the house. Um, and doing a damn good job of having everybody do his dirty work. Um, I take it he's learned something since his season on the show. Um, I really wish they'd do, like, an all-all-stars. Like, I kind of feel like <laughs> these vets have an unfair advantage over these idiots who don't even know the game. Like, I'm all for casting to keep things interesting. Like, I get it. But, like, you should probably get people that know how to play the game if you're gonna make them come back in with people that know how to play the game you know what i mean and learn something from the last time they were on it <sighs> whatever just trying to be the voice of reason sometimes um but anyways so frank's running the house he's just pulling all the strings i i don't even know about paul right now like, Paul threw his best friend under the bus, and he is going to find out soon enough that it's probably Victor that's going to end up coming back in. I wonder if they can talk to the other people before they compete. I wonder if they're in, like, um, sequester together, and they can talk to him. Because if they can, I would be real worried. If they can't, I wouldn't be that worried at all. Um, depending on who comes back in. I would love for it to be Glenn, though, just to fuck shit up. Like, Glenn couldn't sit on a rocket, but somehow beat everybody else because it was a fucking thought competition, you know what I mean? I know these are all crooked, and you can probably tell. I just... These stickers are hard to work with, even though I love them, and they feel great. Like, I... They are really hard to work with. Harder to work with than like odd loop or anything else. It's just my first time like working with this amount of like vinyl, premium matte, whatever you want to call them, stickers. <clears throat> Cause like the odd loop kits or even the Frank Hart 2 kits are made out of the same like paper. Well, I think their paper is thinner. This is some thick ass paper, even though the stickers are super thin. Um. So, I have an extra one of those. I don't know what I'm going to use that with. So, I'm going to go in with the littles in the middle because why not, I guess. Just doing big things today. Doing big things. Um, but yeah, like, I wonder who's going to come back into the game on Big Brother, and then... And then how that's going to go. I mean, if they're in sequester and they don't get to talk to each other... Um, it might be okay if Jose comes back in, but Victor, I feel like if he comes back in, it's going to be not good for anybody. Whew, that peeled up super, super nice. Very surprised. <clears throat> Just had to put that one up a little high because the other one because the full box I put down was really crooked. Um, I feel like Day is, pl Day is like, Day's a love-hate thing for me. Like she, Davon on Big Brother, if I just randomly started saying Day and you're like, what the fuck are you talking about? Um, She's so hit or miss for me because I just feel like 
she's so funny in her diary room sessions and she was her season two like she had me rolling but she doesn't know when to shut her mouth is the problem and like when you don't need to like wind things up you know like stay out of it let other people explode their games for themselves you know like you don't do that to your game. You let them ruin their own game. This is impossible. How am I supposed to do this? The last thing I want to do is peel up a sticker, but... Oh my god, that's even... I have no idea where that cut off. No idea. I was in the middle of still talking about Davon on Big Brother, and then I tried to fix the sticker and I just made it worse. Like it's like stretched in odd angles. It's the best that's gonna happen there. Moving on. Um, but yeah, she just talks too much and she's gonna end up exploding her game by just getting involved in things that she should just really stay out of. <clears throat> so, there is that. Will you stop? Okay. So. All right, so speaking of Big Brother, let's go in with our TVs. And I'm kind of putting little things in the middle, especially with the meals, because I think tracking my lunches is more important to me than tracking my dinners. I'm going to put this, like, paw sticker down for to remind me to give Finn a bath. Because he gets real stanky. Like, I just gave him a bath, like, three days ago, and he already smells. Magic. And then the TV for some big bro. Like. Okay, so that's done. Oh my god, I have Redbox movies that I've had for like a week. I need to take them back. I watched one of them, which was 10 Cloverfield Lane, and it was awful. I personally wasn't impressed. Why? literally could not peel up the sticker for the life of me. <sighs> Sorry, this is all out of order. I'm just going where I can peel stickers. That's how this is happening. Because these are, like, crazy hard to peel. <clears throat> Did I just do both of those? Of course, these tan ones peeled super easy. I'm not going to get mad at it or anything.
There we go. I think I straightened this out finally. And then I'm going to put down a delivery box on Thursday. And then I also have one in tan, so I'm going to put one down on Friday as well. I would hope that I have a couple of these packages that I ordered on 4th of July by Thursday and Friday. <clears throat> and then I have a filming thing in pink. Perfect. That'll work for Saturday. Or what's the other day? Tuesday. I think I'm going to be off on Tuesday. I will probably grab my work schedule. Oh, it's washi that's hanging off the bottom. Oh, I'm off on Saturday and Sunday. That explains it. What is this? What did I work on Tuesday? Yeah, Saturday is going to be a better day for filming. looks a smidge better so I need another TV on Thursday <sighs> so I put one down on Wednesday did not Laundry sticker down on Thursday or Friday. Okay, so I'm going to put this down on Thursday. Oh, whoops. So I have like two bills due this week, or three bills due this week. I have my car payment, which I was originally going to use that sticker for, and then I realized there's a car sticker. So I'll just use this. My internet. And... A credit card payment that's due next week but I get paid on Friday so it's gonna get paid this weekend it's so crooked it's so crooked
So I'm gonna put these two TVs down on Monday for The Bachelorette and Unreal. Cause The Bachelorette will be back. And I do need to catch up on Unreal. I'm about, I saw the first episode of the season but I haven't seen anything else. <clears throat> and down to remind me that there's no advisor calls this week and so this is all I have left on the littles so a heart a TV or is that a calendar thing I don't know that's all I have left uh, my camera's really about to die because it's taking me forever I'm like not even close to done so Let's work with them today, headers. to put this little sticker here because I'm still probably gonna have more to do on Sunday I feel like Sunday is gonna be a long day for me and let's steal this payday sticker and put that down on Friday Crooked. Surprise! Uh, da, 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 da. Shit. I meant to put this little Instagram sticker on Wednesday. I got sidetracked. Well, I'll figure it out. I was gonna put this land sticker down. Maybe I'll put a little box down. I did not realize I would be so close to that one. I don't know why I'm doing this overly matchy matchy, but that's what we're doing. <laughs> 
So there's still a whole bunch of like deco and all that stuff to put down, um, but my camera is literally about to die and cut this off. So we are going to cut it short right here. And this is my plan with me for the So this is what the layout looks like and I'm really, really excited to use it. It's a little busy and I'm not even done with it. But thanks for watching. Bye!